Coming up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. Well, how about the age discrepancy here more than 15 years apart with similar height and reach? All right, now to get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. All right, the wait is over. We are underway here at the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. Do you, do you, baby? This your fight. Oh, that's a big block, Joe. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Nice one-two combination there. Tagged him. So both guys landing at will here. Good action early. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Oh, clipped him with the jab. Nice job moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right Good hand. punches. Well, he gets cracked to the head there, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable. Oh! Front kick to the face! He's got him hurt here. Oh, nice shot! Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Now a right hand! Oh, very nice. It's okay. Straight right, he misses. Boom! Shin to the dome. Oh, tagged him. Hands up. Hands up. Just a slip oh, there. Nice shot. That's what I'm talking about. Whiffs on the right hand. Good straight right. Nice. Look at that. He's timing that jab. Oh, he's got a good Muay Thai clinch here, Joe. Oh. Nice big knee. Big knee. He's got him hurt here. Oh, Finish look there. at this! Who saw that right, coming? Keep moving. Keep moving. You got him on the run. Oh! Yeah, there you go. Good shot. Good shot. Two minutes have expired here in our opening round. Circle to the left. Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Punish the lead leg with the low kick. How that's about that it, shin? That's it. Joey missed with that straight right attempt. Protect your face. Hands up. Not there. Hey, he's off balance. Take him down. Here's the shot. Take nice shot. jab. Nice. Keep up with the strikes. Very nice. And he's looking for that left. Be first, be first. Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. Oh, that was a big left hand he connected with. Oh, he left his head wide open to absorb that straight hand. He has shown a vulnerability here by leaning in right into his opponent's range. That one hurt. Take down. And there he swung with a haymaker. Big hook. Just misses there with the left. Good left hook. Over under hooks here. And now he's got the tie clinch. Muay Thai clinch now, Joe. A lot of damage can be done here. Oh, he's hurt! He is hurt! Man! It's I. It's I. End this. It's over. Oh! Come on, let's finish this. Straight right hand, no good. That's what I'm talking about. Keep doing it again. Do it again. Body kick, look at that. Let's go, take this. Ooh, blocks the shot. Right. Relax. 30 seconds to go. Finds his range with the jab.
blocks that strike. Oh, wow! Finish, finish, finish! He's in trouble. Finish this! Ten more seconds. Come Final on. seconds of round one. Keep circling. Keep circling. Nice. Misses a huge hook to the head. What right, a fight strike. so Easy. far. Good job. Way to finish the round. Nice. Way to go. Listen, you almost had him finished, but the round came at the end. Here's a vicious kick that results in a knockdown. Let's take a look at that again. Let's see it one more time. Brittany Palmer doing her thing as usual. Round two underway. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Caught him with a punch. And a nice jab. Oh, Another head kick. One. Another one. Oh, that cut has really opened up now, Joe. Oh, tagged him. Oh, nice. Oh, he's, oh. Hurt. he's in big, big, big finish, trouble. Finish, finish. Wow! Come on, let's finish this. Wow! Oh! oh. But that one really hurt him. Finish him. Well, back to his feet here, Joe, but look at him. He is hurting for certain. That man is in a world of trouble. Lands a good shot from the bottom. He's got double underhooks here. He transitions to the tie clinch. Knees right here. He's got to get those knees to the body. He lands one. Tying him up here in the clinch. Nice jab. There you go. Keep popping that jab just like that. He's looking to land the right just out of range. Don't stop. Keep going. Keep going. Well, this is live in real time. We didn't hit the replay button. Again, he gets cracked to the head because, again, he's leaning in, almost moving right into his opponent's striking range. Elbow. Knees. Right up the middle. Locks up the plum. He moves to the Muay Thai clinch. Let's go. Let's go. Keep it up. Just over three minutes to go in round two. Knee, knee, knee. Oh, good left hand. Oh, nice shot. Oh! oh. This could be oh. it. Oh! Go in for the Whoa, he tagged him. Finish him. He's hurt. He's hurt. Finish him. Finish him. Back to his feet again. Amazing. Oh. He front kicked him in the oh. face. Oh, he's Another hurt. Another knockdown. Oh, that is it! Goodness! Oh my goodness! Gigantic hook that got him the win. Yeah, there's another one for the highlight reel, Joe, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighter saw it coming. So a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. And let's see that again. Boom! And that is all she wrote. So a huge result and a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the big knockout win. That could hold up as one of the better KOs of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 16 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Ferrari! So just the way he drew it up here tonight, what a monumental moment and knockout to get his hand raised here tonight. He kept the judges out of it. He is certainly... All right, coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight showdown. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So three years, the gap in age between these two fighters with similar height and some differences in reach. All right, now with the official introductions, we go inside the octagon of Bruce Buffer. 
third man in the octagon for this one. Okay, let's go. Nice Don't knee to the body. The fight, Opens up with a front kick. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Just out of range with that left hook. And he lands it to the leg. Nice uppercut. Wow! Big right hand. Keep moving. Keep moving. You got him on a rope. Get your arm underneath his chin and throw knees. Knees. Try to establish that jab. Got double underhooks. Locks up the plum. Elbows, knees, elbows, knees. He's wide open, knees. Double underhooks. Wow, that was a quick takedown. Oh, he got tagged with the right hand there. And busy as he looks to improve position here. He lands a big shot from the bottom. Getting the ground and pound going pretty good here early. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Well, you got to be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. Lands Huge a big elbow, elbow there. to the head. Trying to get into side control here. Can't make it. Big hey, body shot, shot to the body. Passes out of half guard and into side control. Get back up. One underhook here. His head. Spin out to the side. Two minutes have gone by here, round one. Nice, good, good. You can't handle your strike. Lands a trip Open and gets guard, him on the ground. Open up the guard and flatten him out. Posture up and finish him. Slice the knee through. Let's go. A little bit uneventful. Oh, there's a good shot from the bottom. Open up that guard. Open up the guard. Get to one knee. Excellent Stop. posture. Press the knee down. Landed that one. Top four is going down to the basement. Good shot to the head. Moves into half guard. Big punch from the bottom. Tags him with a flush left. Excellent movement here on the ground. Start raining those elbows. Start raining those Side elbows. control. Under two minutes now to go in round one. That's what I'm talking about. Keep doing it again. Do it again. Big shot. He's back in his side control here. Knee up belly, go to mount. He's moved back to north-south. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Tags Making him. all these shots count. Into side control again. Half guard here. Postures up here. Exactly like that. Don't Big move, shot from the keep bottom. Moving, keep moving. Tries to pass here, but gets shut down. Move. Scramble. Come on out. Oh, he got reversed. A better, position, a better position. 60 seconds. Push, push. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Posture. Posture. Elbows. Grab He's posturing up here. Grab him. Hold him down. Beautiful oh, timing with the left hand. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. And he's on top! So we cross the 30-second mark in our opening round. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. Keep moving. Give him some more. Give him some more. He's moved back into side control once more. On Round one winding down here. Huh. 
Horn stop. sounds for the end of round one. Stop, stop, stop. Here's a vicious kick that results in a knockdown. Let's take a look at that from a different camera. And let's see that from another angle. All right, hey, hey, come on in, come on in. Great finish to that round. Give him some water, give him some water, listen. Brittany Palmer in the building tonight. Second round underway. Finds a home for that left hook. Oh, huge shot there. Oh! That's it. Nice shot. That one hurt. Yeah, he's getting lit up here. Oh, he got tagged there. And follows up with another one. The battle for hooks continues. He's got double underhooks now. Oh, he connects there. Man, the body work continues to be a factor here. Look at the size of that bruise on his body. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw offense. Staying busy here. You like to see that, Joe. And he connects with the punch there. And now he's in full mount. Half guard. Now let's get a full pass. Good shot. Now he's moved back in a full guard. Excellent posture here. Covering up, doing a nice job of stopping that ground and pound. Big punch from the bottom. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. Back to half guard now. Keep working, keep working. Start raining those elbows. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Side control, side and he connects control. with the punch. To Moves to north-south. Just over three minutes now to go in round two. Keep working that hug. Inside control once again. Excellent movement here on the ground. He moves to the Mount of Crucifix. This is ugly. Back to side control. It appears that cut is getting worse. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. He's established mounted crucifix. Elbows, elbows. He's got a half guard here. Good control, postures up. All right, let's get a full pass now. He's back to full mount again. That landed. He's on top on the back. And he's flattening him out. Well, he's on his back now, going for the rear naked choke. We'll see if he can get under the chin. Trying to work that arm under the neck for the choke. He's got it. He's got the arm under the neck now. He wants to get it underneath the chin. Gets that bicep on the hand. Gets the other hand on the back of the head. Outstanding. And there it is. Outstanding. He got the choke for the tap. So yeah, it came down to tap out or go to sleep, and his opponent chose the former. The choke was clearly sunk in deep, perfect technique, and ultimately that is one of the bigger wins of his career. He gets it done by submission here tonight. And here's the end. And here we see it from another angle. Beautiful technique here, and the tap. And finally, one more time, no choice but to tap. So there he is, your winner by submission, and that's exactly how you put the rest of this division on notice. Looks like this guy could be a factor moving forward in this division.
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Amasaki is called to stop to this contest at three minutes, two seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out, Scott! Well, at this point, all that is left is the celebration, and it's nice to see this fighter sharing a moment with his coaches and training partners after the big submission win here tonight. All right, coming up next, it's a UFC light heavyweight division collision. And now our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight fight. More than five years apart with similar height and reach. All right, now for the particulars, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Donetsk, Ukraine, Cecilia. And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of S. West Germany, Juggernaut. Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch him up and we are underway. And we are underway. Let's go. Lots of movement for me. Keep those hands high. And he connects there, Joe. Now. Here we go. Here we go. You start the fight. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Keep that Protect jab working. Protect your face. Hands up. Nice kick. Big power in that kick. Oh, head kick. Just misses with the straight right. Good defense there. Takedown attempt there. Early takedown is good. No surprise here, Joe. Very evident he wants this fight on the ground. Working from the mounted crucifix. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Tags him. Looking for the choke. Looking for the choke. It looks like he's got that north-south choke locked in. That choke is deep. This could be it right here. And there it is! Great job in establishing that submission. Well, yeah, Joe, that was fun while it lasted. He told us he wanted to be at his most efficient here tonight. He certainly didn't waste a lot of time. He knew he wanted to get the fight to the ground. He gets the early takedown, and the submission follows shortly thereafter. And here's the end of the fight. Let's see it one more time. Got the arm in deep under the neck, locked in tight, and it's over before they even get a chance to tap. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. So a seminal moment for him here tonight, Joe Rogan, as he gets the win by way of submission. Certainly one of the bigger wins of his career and as big a statement as he could have made here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at one minute, six seconds of the very first round. For the winner, by submission, Cecilia!
Well, the celebration is on in the corner after the big submission win here tonight. He told us during fight week that he needed to prioritize a finish here. Decisions were not going to be enough to take his career where he wants to take it and expeditiously. So, gets the submission tonight. Now the celebration is on. There got to be few things in all of pro sports as satisfying than to be able to celebrate a UFC win with your coaches and training partners. And thankfully for this young man,